Talk about art the way you talk about everything. Don't try to talk like a pointy-headed intellectual academic. Write the way you talk. Talk the way you think. Hi, my name's Jerry Saltz. I'm the senior art critic for New York Magazine and the author of the book, How to Be an Artist. Let yourself be the Philistine that you are. I'm one, you're one, everybody's an artist because creativity is a survival mechanism of our species. We would not have survived without it. So trust me, trust yourself, it's there. Let's hear your stupid thoughts. Then I'll share mine. Then we'll gore each other to death. Abstract art can be really hard to look at. Ask yourself, how was this made? When was it made? What did other art look like at the time it was made? And how might this change the definition of art? Find other people that might be making things or trying to live more creatively like you and commune with them. See as much as you can. Look, 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 keep looking, keep looking, never stop looking. Then work, work, work. Get yourself to work, you big baby. Work. I want you to walk around in museums and galleries and ask yourself this question. What would I like about this work of art if I were the kind of person that liked it? And suddenly a little list will start appearing of good qualities, bad qualities, the odd things, the weird things. You don't know this, but you're becoming an art historical critical genius. If you turn to the person next to you in any museum or gallery, ask them, what do you think of this? You will be shocked at the amazing things you hear. Then you will share with them your thoughts and they'll think you're a genius too. It'll be good. Mini MacArthur's for everyone. If it's horizontal, it's probably something like a landscape. If it's vertical, it's probably something like a portrait. And also, a bonus, everything is a little bit figurative, even when it seems like it's not. It's in there.